We're on your side tonight with a new campaign bringing promise to our troops. Two months ago here on On Your Side Tonight, we told you the U.S. Army experienced its worst recruitment year in five decades. The Army came up 15,000 soldiers short of its goal of 60,000 new recruits in 2022. Well, now the Army is asking the next generation if they're ready to be all they can be. They ran head on into a fortified base camp defended by four battalions of the enemy. This is war in Vietnam, a distant memory for some, but not for 18 year old John Mitchell. My grandfather served and I decided to continue. Three months ago, he entered this Anderson recruitment office with a list of careers he'd like to do. Um, I'm going to be a wheeled vehicle mechanic. 91 Bravo. He also came in with a list of places he'd like to see. Uh, Germany, South Korea, Japan, and maybe Hawaii. He's a teen already capitalizing on possibilities in the U.S. Army. It means finding your purpose in life and pursuing it to the very end. Take whatever it is that you think you are of yourself and push it to the limits. There's nothing stopping you. There's no place but up. We do more before 9 a.m. than most people do all day. In 1981, it was Chief of Staff of the Army, General James C. McConville, watching this commercial with the Be All You Can Be tagline. The slogan resonated then, which is why it's returning now. And we did the analysis, we did the studies, we found that Be All You Could Be resonated with the youth today, it also resonated with the influences, the parents, and that's why we're rolling out the Be All You Can Be campaign. Last fiscal year, the Army fell short of its recruitment goal by 25%. In a memo addressing recruitment and retention challenges, the service began working on a rebrand to close what they consider gaps in knowledge, trust, and identity. I think it closes many of the gaps uh, that we're seeing. General McConville says the new brand is reversing assumptions about military life and opportunities. The branch also has 200 careers and counting. I've changed my job three times. I got bored. <laughs> We're a profession of professions. You can do anything you want to do in the United States Army. You can be a certainly a master of combat arms. You can be a doctor. You can be a lawyer. You can be an engineer. You can be a cyber warrior. You can do anything you want to do, and you can make a difference and be part of something bigger than yourself. General McConville is firm. Even with a new campaign, the Army will not lower standards. To better prepare prospects, a future soldier preparatory course is available at Fort Jackson, South Carolina to help address academic and physical fitness barriers to meet or exceed Army ascension standards. They come in, try out the Army, if they meet the standards, they can continue to go on to serve. If they don't, we thank them for trying out. We send them home, and they go on and do something else for the society. U.S. Army is still offering enlistment and quick ship bonuses. There's also a two-year enlistment option. The Army's goal this year is to bring in 65,000 new soldiers in all.